last night's camp. Okay, here we are. Day number three. Leaving the campsite. We pulled up short last night. We were running out of daylight and um, so we've got about 30 k's to get out of this and then we are um, a bit more blacktop for a while. We even awoke to a little bit of rain last night. It was only a light drizzle so hopefully that just keeps the dust down for the rest of this, we've got about an hour to go on this track, or 50 minutes to be exact. And this will pop us out uh, near Majura. I went to start the bike this morning, and um, yeah, she uh, the battery hesitated for a bit. So I'll see how it goes. We've got a jump starter in that, but um, it's gonna hurt. We've got a jump starter. So if it gives me curry tomorrow morning, it might have just been an off. And if it gives me curry, I will um, get a new one at Port Augusta if I can. Highly unlikely, but. That would be the only place, otherwise it'll be a um, uh, jump starter until I get home. I don't know whether the camera's picking it up. Heaps of uh, spider webs across the road. They're everywhere. Definitely an adventurous track, the one we've just done. And if that's the sort of thing that uh, floats your boat, scratches the itch, uh, definitely check it out. Actually, I was going to get my compressor out, but I might just have a look if they've got air here. Just looking for some air. Psst, psst, psst. Okay, we didn't fuel up here, we're going to um, hightail it to Eucla, which is 182 k's down the road. We've all got plenty of fuel for that. Boys is right behind me.
Okay, we're refueled and had some lunch. Kunadala Homestead Might get some fuel Dead. All made of sleepers from the railway by the looks of it. Could be from the railway line. The old graveyard, we'll go out and have a look at that in a minute. She would have been hard yakka back in the day. It's even got a bath still. And a vanity. Shower. <coughs> Old caro heater. And the old metas. Icy cold drink.
So that's the old homestead done and dusted. Well worth a look. And um, Rob's on the wrong road. Okay, we've regrouped. <laughs> Rob realised he's about 10 minutes down the road. So we just stayed where we lost him and waited. And back he come. Alright, we've got roughly um, an hour and a half, I believe, to get to the Nullarbor Roadhouse where we're going to just top up. Decided to push on. So we've just pulled into Nundru and we're going to see if we can get a um, unpowered side or something here. <coughs> Last night's cosy accommodation. Master, ensuite, single. <laughs> hey, it did the job. Uh, 50 bucks each, and it was way better than sleeping out. Got down to minus two here, out this way last night. All right, time to hit the road. She was gonna be fresh here last night, and none of the roadside parking bays, camping spots really tickled our fancy, they were all full, so we just, yeah, bolted to Nundru, got a room, 50 bucks each, can't go wrong. We're just going to bolt down the road a bit, grab a coffee at Penong, and um, hightail it down to Willara. Welcome to downtown Sejuna. This will be our border check here for fruit and vegetables. And as easy as that. Hey. On our way to the Gawla Ranges, we spent probably 40 minutes in Sejuna. Had a look around, not much to do in old Sejuna. There you go, matey. Which way to the Gawla Ranges? Uh, one of those guys, eh? i 
Australia Heave away, haul away We're bound for South Australia Heave away, haul away We're bound for South Australia Heave away, haul away We're bound for South Australia Destination for tonight. We'll suss out the submarine in the morning, but um, it's relatively early. Oh, I'm still on Perth time. It's 1:30, probably about two o'clock, 2:30, and we're just going to have a short day today. We've had a couple of big days in the wind, so today's just a nice, casual, cruisy day. find out what we're doing and then I'll uh, bring you back. Mount Ives Station, home for the night. 